Well, most Utahns have had more than their fill of treacherous winter driving by now. Oh my gosh, a couple drives this past winter have definitely stand mm. out in my mind. I think my knuckles are still white. <laughs> <laughs> However, Fox 13 News reporter Jenna Bree introduces us to a local bus driver who loves nothing more than driving up and down our canyons on the snowiest days in a way that is positively Utah. I know every turn, every curve, when it gets dark outside or in the first thing in the mornings, I know where I'm at. So. Every time Josh Mamea gets behind the bus wheel, he says he's living his childhood dream. Ever since I was about six or seven, I've always wanted to be a bus driver. Had a, always a fascination with buses in general. Riders know him as Uncle Maui. My name is Maui, as you can tell. The nickname given to him by his nieces due to his resemblance to the character from the Disney movie Moana. He announced himself as Maui and we all laughed. And we were on a very crowded bus. So he's like, we'll make it as smooth as possible. And he's just making jokes with us the whole time. UTA's ski bus service ends this weekend, even though some of the resorts plan on staying open for at least another month. This winter has made driving up the canyons difficult and dangerous, but Maui says he's going to miss his favorite routes. I just love meeting the people. Being in the mountains, I love the outdoors anyway, so what a better way to, to be than to be on my bus in the mountains. Some riders spend every weekend trying to get on Maui's bus. He's got a great, great personality and like all his bus rides are super smooth and it's super fun. With UTA cutting the ski bus service in half this season and the constant snow exacerbating traffic problems, Maui says many riders have been frustrated. I do feel the, the frustration, but I think that's where my personality comes in. A lot on the weekends, our buses are packed full, so there there is tension, but on my bus, it's always a light mood. I always make sure people feel comfortable, feel safe. In Big Cottonwood Canyon, Jenna Breen, Fox 13 News, Utah. Seems like a great guy. Thanks, Jenna. Resorts like Alta, Deer Valley, and Snow Basin are closing next weekend, but Brighton, Solitude, and Snowbird, they plan on staying open well into May. We do have a full list of the closing dates for all of Utah's resorts on our website. You can find it at fox13now.com.